Hi everyone, welcome to class. Today we'll be talking about Texas stories. This week we'll be focusing on the Comanche culture in Texas and we'll be making scratch art inspired by Comanche rock drawings. The supplies you'll need for this project are a box top, crayons, dish soap, black paint, acrylic or tempera, a paintbrush, and a toothpick or something to scratch with. Before we get started with our art lesson, pause this video and click on the link above to watch a video explaining the Comanche experience in Texas. Now that you've watched the documentary, you have a better understanding of the Comanche experience. In step two, we'll cut out our box top surface. In step three, we'll color the background with crayons. Then we'll mix soap with paint and apply that to our background. After your paint dries, we'll scratch in your artwork. Our final product will look something like this. Step two, take out your box top and begin to cut it into a rectangular shape. I'm using a recycled cereal box, but you can use any box top that's made of cardboard. We're using cardboard because we want a stiff surface. Paper will tend to buckle once we paint on it, but cardboard will not. Step three, now take out your crayons you can choose whatever colors you'd like. What we're trying to do is apply crayon or the wax from the crayon all over our background. This will serve as a resist and allow us to scratch into it once we cover it with paint. It's important that we cover the entire surface with crayon. Step four. This is the fun part. You're going to mix one part soap with one part paint. So basically half soap, half paint. Mix that together and begin to paint that over your crayon colored surface. Make sure you go all the way to the edge and apply it as evenly as you possibly can. I was careful to not paint on my table so I put down a paper towel. Step five. This is our final step. If you remember from the Comanche video, several things came to light. The Comanches used teepees as their living structure. Horses were very important, buffalo as well. So I just sketched some of those quickly on a scrap sheet of paper and then began to scratch those into my ground. I used that as inspiration. Basically, I wanted to take the elements from the Comanche culture and build my composition or my picture from those elements. In my composition, I used the buffalo horn the teepee, the horse, a necklace, a water jug, and an arrowhead. Give it a try. Have fun. I hope you enjoyed today's project, and hopefully it gave you a new tool that you can add to your artist toolkit. Today's class was sponsored by ArtSpark Texas, and you can find information about their nonprofit in the link below. Thanks. Don't forget, you can like, share, and subscribe to our channel. The link to donate can be found in the description below. Thank you to our ArtSpark funders, Texas Commission on the Arts, National Endowment for the Arts Creative Forces, St. David's Foundation, Austin Public Library, Cultural Arts City of Austin, and the Donald D. Hamill Foundation.